Hey everybody, it's Christina of Crafty Paws. Wanted to share with you guys an art journal page. This is my entry into Mina Scrapper's giveaway challenge, and that's Matea. Hi! Um, she has a challenge going on through the end of July, and it is basically to motivate us to use those dies or die cuts that we have and have not used. So I took this die out. It's a Tim Holtz Alterations die. It's um, a butterfly and it's called Fanciful Flight. And I had gotten this in a bundle package with a couple of other things on an eBay purchase, an auction, um, probably about five months ago. And I never used this one. So I knew once I saw her challenge that I wanted to try this. Um, and then I just decided to play. I took a big sheet of... Um, this is just, it's mixed media paper because I knew I wanted to spray it and I needed kind of a heavyweight paper to absorb the sprays. I used for the background these three recollection sprays that I got uh, on clearance. One is green shimmer, one is blue shimmer, and one is purple shimmer. And there is some shimmer, but not a ton. But that's okay, I wanted it to be a background and not compete with all of the flying insects. Then I decided I was just going to play with all the different configurations that I could make with this die. And the wings come separate, and they come with a top layer that has kind of the veining, vein-like portion, and then it comes with a flat layer that you can lay underneath it. And you have to flip the papers if they have a texture on it or something like that so you can make them match because it's basically one, two, three um, different pieces and then one, two of the flat, not the vein pieces. Um, so I, I'm just trying to describe it because it's so hard to see just the black. Um, and then I just cut out a whole bunch of pieces of black cardstock as well as this beautiful handmade background paper that was gifted to me by Rosa, who's Color Explosion by Rosa. Um, she gifted me these wonderful background papers and she does these amazing process videos. If you guys don't know her, you should definitely check her out. And I use those papers to cut out these beautiful colors for these butterflies. And I just love how different they all are and how unique each insect looks. Um, I also just took my Uniball pen and kind of traced, you know, drew lines, dashed lines to, you know, imitate the flight paths of the various insects, swirls, and, um, and then I just played with different configurations. This one is just like the one on the front cover of the die. This one is two sets of the lower wings. This one is one set of just the upper wings, the one side. So I didn't do it reflective like I did this one because I wanted this one to look like it was flying in that direction as opposed to flying up. Um, these are like little moths that I just used the lower portion for. Um, and then just to add some more fun, I added different color sequins. Um, and lastly, and this is what really motivated me besides uh, Matea's challenge is I've, I've been thinking about how, you know, different people come from all different walks of life, have different challenges, have different um, resources, but I truly believe that, you know, you can achieve anything if you really try and put everything you have behind it. Um, so I thought with all the different kinds of flying insects that I was able to kind of create, I thought this sentiment, which I just printed out on my printer, uh, would be appropriate. And it says, you can soar with whatever wings you have. So, you know, of course, if you have less, um, like these little moths, you, can't, you can probably have a harder time flying in harsh winds or something like that. But perhaps even with large wings, if the gusts of winds are really strong, then you would struggle more, maybe with more surface area. Who knows? Um, I don't know, I'm kind of rambling and babbling now, but I just wanted to share this with you guys and um, encourage you guys to play along. I'll put a link in the description box below to Minna Scrapper, that's her YouTube channel, and uh, her giveaway challenge, and uh, I hope you guys are having a great day. Bye!